morning guys okay so i'm whispering this morning because it's currently 5 20 and if you're if you're wondering why i'm looking a bit greasy i've got a face mask on <laughs> looking nice at 5 20 in the morning but today i'm off to new york i'm so excited um yeah i'm going to new york with my friend libby we've been planning it for months um i actually haven't mentioned it um online but yeah, we're leaving this morning. We're leaving at six o'clock actually, but I've got a few things to do before I go. Um, and I'm trying to be quiet because little one is still asleep and I'm trying to keep it that way. Um, mixed emotions about this trip because I'm so excited about going, but it's the first time I've left River for longer than, I've left her for two nights to go to a wedding before, um, but it's the first time I've left her for like going on a trip and it's three nights and I'm really nervous because I just, I'm, I know I'm gonna miss her, but it's gonna be so much fun. So yeah, I'm gonna take you guys along with me. I'm gonna vlog. I haven't been to New York since last February. So I am super, super excited. Um, yeah, let's go, let's go to the airport. It feels really weird. It feels like I'm stepping back in time to my pre-pregnancy, like pre-baby days. Um, I'm gonna go and wash this mask off because I look like freaky, crazy greasy person. We are on the road, on the way to the airport. Libby is here. Hello. Internet, you meet Libby. You've already <laughs> met her a few times, but this is who I'm gonna be hanging out with for the next few days. And we are listening. I've just been raiding Libby's selection of CDs in her car, which she says are her brothers, but I mean, I don't know if I believe her. There are some classics in there, lots of Robbie Williams, lots of uh, power ballads. I think there was like 100 greatest power ballads. Yeah. Guilty? Guilty. Yes. And um, the Cranberries. Oh, the Cranberries. And we settled on a CD called The Sound of Bread. <laughs> Turns out Bread sounds pretty good. 70s band called Bread. I had never heard of them before, but I'm potentially now a fan. <laughs> the sun is out. I feel like, you know those days where you're like, why, why am I leaving England? Why are we leaving now? We could have left at any point in the last year when it was raining for a full year straight, pretty much. Yeah. We're leaving now. As you may be able to tell, I may have got a little bit distracted in the airport. Whoopsie. Um, I forgot to vlog until I was here, but I'll show you what is in this soon. Me and Libby are a little bit overexcited right now because we chose our seats last night and chose the like, ones at the front. Did not realize they're actually bringing new economy. I didn't get charged for mine because I'm like a BA member. I think Libby got charged like 90 pounds, but they're actually really, really nice. So we're really, really chuffed about it. Oh, this trip is starting well. We have arrived, guys. We've actually checked into our hotel room. It's pretty good. You happy, Libs? I am very happy. <laughs> And we're and now, the and the sun is shining, we've got our sunglasses on, might have purchased some new sunglasses in the airport, <laughs> oh, um, and we're now on our way to find cookie dough, basically, yes. I'm so hungry, I always feel like I eat so much when I have been on a yeah, plane, I mean, and I don't even know why, like, I just get ravaging, ravenous, ravaging, ravenous, ravenously hungry. Guys, we've been here for approximately an hour, and this is our first. <laughs> The diet is going out the window this weekend. Look at this cake batter cookie dough and a vanilla pink cone. I mean, cheers, love. <laughs> it's like cocktails, but not. Everywhere I come, yeah, I stalk <laughs> the sausage dogs. Look at this guy. Come this way. Hello. We just found the cutest shop. Everything is so summery. It's making me want to go on summer holiday. This is something I've never seen in New York before. It's an English shop sells all the English stuff. Not that we're gonna be eating any of that this weekend. Oh, Sephora, my old friend, how I have missed you. I haven't been in here in so long. We are now in anthropology and I love these beach bags. <laughs> what have you found? Oh my God, they're so nice. Oh wait, that was really out of focus. Starry sandals. Me and Libby share our mutual love for stars. Um, also, absolutely <laughs> back off their mind. We basically have matching outfits for this whole weekend. I love these and they don't have an F. I'm really sad about it. So it's like 7 p.m. now. I have hit a serious jet lag wall. I feel like my eyes are 
so red. <laughs> My feet are hurting. Um, but we are heading to her house for a drink and then we're gonna go get some food. I'm hungry, I'm tired. We're not going back to the hotel because so like, I I would just die. If I sat if I sat on the bed, it, it would be KO for the rest of the night. So we're not going back. We're powering through and we may have bought quite a lot of things already. Guys, what is this? There's a crazy rainstorm going on. Thunder and lightning. We've had all, all the weather today. All of it. Good morning from New York. It's a bit noisy because we are currently walking, or headed, approaching the Brooklyn Bridge, which I've never done before. I've been to New York so many times. I've never walked across it. How beautiful is today? Yes. We stopped for some brunch at a place called Sunday in Brooklyn. This is mine. Looks so good. Libby got the most amazing mine looking. Looks yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it was like, ah, I win. Got some juices. Enjoying the sunshine. So we're currently on our way to Maria Tash because I've been thinking about getting another piercing. Thinking about it for a while. So we're just gonna go and have a little look and see what happens. Huh. Maybe. Just have a little look. I don't know. I don't know. Oh my god, guys. I did it! This little dude is my new addition. Little lightning bolt. I've wanted it for ages. I'm so excited I finally did it. Um, we didn't actually film it because she wouldn't let us film in there, which I thought was a bit weird, but um, well, I guess not. She's piercing. Maybe she'll lose her concentration. We're now actually in Nike looking for some trainers, but I'm buzzing. And, and aching a little bit. It's getting to that point now where it's like stinging. But it didn't hurt at all. It was actually, she was a really good piercer. Ashley and Maria Tash. Thanks. Guys, there's something crazy going on right now. I don't know what is going on. There's a massive fire. Is it a protest? We don't know. What is going on? So it turns out, guys, that was just a pile of rubbish on fire that people were like standing really close to, taking photos of. It was, near, it was a car. near a car that has a petrol tank. We were like, why is everyone standing next to it? It's clearly going to explode in about 10 minutes. Um, hopefully not. We can hear the fire, like we can hear the fire engines that are approaching. Yeah. Right. Hopefully they're going to put that out in time. Otherwise, not going to be good. We are headed to a hotel of one of Libby's friends, which is there. We're going to that rooftop. Yes, yes, yes. Good morning, guys. Welcome to our second uh, proper day in New York. I didn't finish my vlog last night because we ended up in hospital. Um, don't worry, it was neither of us. <laughs> Basically, the last time I vlogged, we actually were on our way to meet one of Libby's friends um, and we had a drink with her and then as we were about to leave, a guy came running over and was like, your friend has collapsed, collapsed in, the in the toilet. So we were obviously, they called an ambulance. She ended up being fine, she was absolutely fine and we were all laughing about it by the end of the night. Um, <laughs> but we ended up in uh, ER um, and it was interesting. So we missed dinner. She was supposed to be going to the theater. She missed the theater. Um, and we ended up eating like Shake Shack at half past midnight, totally <laughs> delirious in our hotel room. <laughs> um, so it was an interesting evening. It's now really, really gray in New York. The sunshine is gone from yesterday, which is sad times, sad times. A bit rainy, a bit miserable, but we're on our way to eat some breakfast. I'm so hungry. We're going to a place called Two Hands, which looks really, really good. So we're actually staying in Chinatown at a hotel called 50 Bowery. Um, and we're just walking down Bowery now. We're on our way um, into like Nolita, which is where Two Hands is. But um, I've never stayed down in Chinatown before. It's not an area I've, I've spent a lot of time in, but it's actually quite a good location because the hotel was it wasn't like cheap, but for New York, it was like pretty good value. Um, I'll show you the hotel later, but um, yeah, it would definitely rate it. So it's like walkable to Soho. So that's what's going on. Get me some coffee. I got a very good looking little acai bowl, but I'm slightly jealous of Lily's breakfast once again. 
Look at those eggs. Ah. So we've come up to Fifth Avenue. I think we're crazy because it's Saturday and it's so busy. But we're doing a little bit of shopping, heading to dinner. We're actually going to see The Lion King tonight, which I'm very excited about because I haven't been to see it since I was about 10. And I'm on the hunt. We're coming back into Sephora right now because I'm on the hunt for the Sunday Riley Foundation. Sold out everywhere in my shade. Fingers crossed. Yes, guys, they have it. This is like the fifth Sephora I've tried. Guys, I'm so happy I found this. I'm so excited to try it. I've literally looked in, I think, five Sephora. Well, that was number five, I think. But yeah, I'm really excited for this. We have stopped for a quick dinner before we go to the theatre and are having Aperol spritzes. This is one of the things I missed the most when I was pregnant. I love Aperol spritz so much. Dinner has arrived, guys. Got some oh, ND, endive, endive, however they say it here, chicory, basically, chicory salad with prawns, Lib's got a steak, and I can smell those truffle fries from here. They smell so good. They, I'm just gonna take one, I'm just gonna take one. Guys, we're on our way to the theatre. We're in Times Square, yay! But what the hell happened to the weather? Umbrella is here, this is miserable. It was so sunny yesterday. That was so good, guys, I feel like I am like 12 again and I nearly ended up shouting Olivia a really awkward moment about how shiny Simba's pecs were um, but it's a good job I got to pecs and then everyone went silent I was like pecs? <laughs> so we've just got back to the hotel room I've just taken all my makeup off and it's one of those days where it just feels so good and I got a package when we arrived back in the hotel um, my friend Raquel who lives out here had sent a package to our hotel look at this it's three little baby grows for Bugsy and they're so cute they're zippy ones as well oh, I just nearly dropped my camera I'm that tired they're zippy ones as well which I love and they've all got stars on them thanks Raquel super cute oh and we got roses and champagne from Libby's friend who we went to hospital with last night. Um, so yeah, full of treats. And I'm about to clean my piercing Ugh. so it doesn't get, <laughs> well, just like hold the like, I've got these little sterile um, like saline pad things that I just hold on there for five minutes. Um, so I'm gonna do that before bed. And I'll see you in the morning. I'm literally about to pass out. The taxi journey back here was hairy, let me tell you guys. He was going so fast, like a crazy person, and it was raining, and I was like falling asleep in the back, like, I'm so tired, I'm slightly delirious, and my eyes are like, I feel like they're gonna fall out of my face. When you miss home when you're in New York, <laughs> watch Sunday Morning in London. What? <laughs> Good morning, welcome to our final morning. I have got my Nanette de Gaspé face mask on, I've worn this every day since I've been here because it was a gift. They're super expensive and amazing and I've been getting the most out of using it. But yeah, today is our last day. Sad to be leaving but I've just been FaceTiming Mike and River and she has changed. Even in like three days, it sounds crazy, but like she's picked up new little things and habits and stuff. So um, I'm excited to see how we're gonna get packing now, which is my least favorite thing to do. Ugh. So I'm currently in Cezanne trying on beautiful dresses. I actually didn't know this had opened in New York and it's such a pretty store. So guys, it's our last and final meal in New York for the airport probably. Um, and I've managed to convince Libby to come to Blue Ribbon Sushi, which is a big thing because this one does not eat fish. I eat tuna no mayonnaise fish. and tuna mayonnaise, no fish. <laughs> um, so she doesn't like sushi, obviously. But I did um, try fried chicken. But she's managed to find fried chicken and I've got this plate of amazingness. I'm so excited. Mike would be so jealous. Guys, one of my best friends is getting married in like two weeks time and I just found this super cute um, tea towel in anthropology. So pretty. about to take off. Me neither. Sad times. But well, we've got the same seats again. Ooh, I made it home, guys. <laughs> <laughs> yes, little one, are you squeaking? Are you talking? Um, I made it back home, it's actually an amazing day, so I'm sitting in the garden 
with little shouty river. Um, I'm sitting in the garden. It's about six o'clock now. I've actually been home for a little while, but I've just been chilling with the little one. Um, and I thought I would end my New York vlog here. You are very vocal this evening. <laughs> um, yeah, I had such a great trip and I hope you guys enjoyed seeing a little snippet of it. We obviously, I didn't actually vlog that much of it. I kind of just vlogged bits and bobs. So I hope this vlog has made sense. I hope you've had a really good weekend and I will see you very soon if you can hear me. Because you're talking so loud. <laughs> I'll speak to you soon, guys. Bye.